Alright y'all, uh, <clears throat> about to do this video here, we're going to review the, um, the new Ken Hang 500 gig hard drive, I know you guys are familiar with this one, the one that looks like a tape, uh, it's the 2 terabyte one, this one's bigger than, than this one, but this is the new one and um, we're going to see how, you know, what games are on it and um, pretty much, you know, what, uh, what what it has on it, so alright I'm about to plug it in let's see <clears throat> alright plugged it in alright here we go oh, sorry alright alright oh the folders popped up yeah okay that's the share folder, this is the better share folder, but this is not how you boot it up. You gotta boot it up with the BIOS thing, like the 2 terabyte one, so. So, <clears throat> we're gonna hold shift and then restart the computer. Troubleshoot, advanced options, and UEFI firmware, and restart one. Alright, there we go. Uh, like I said in other videos, as far as the BIOS screen, Depending on what kind of laptop or computer you have, I'm using a Lenovo laptop. This is a pretty, I would say, two-year-old laptop. It's an i3 Intel. Um, and so you know, my BIOS kind of looks like this. If yours, I'm sure yours might look different, but the process is still the same. And what I was saying before in the other videos, um, you gotta make sure you know you gotta. You gotta choose secure boot. The secure boot, you gotta turn that off. Any security, you gotta make sure that's disabled, right? Now, I already have mine disabled. Um, I, the first time I did it, I kind of just left it there. I mean, it, it really nothing's gonna affect your computer. I mean, you turn your security off, but that's that's just my choice. But I left it off after I, I booted up the two terabyte one, so it wasn't no big deal. But you gotta make sure um, that you choose to have the hard drive boot up first. So you kind of move that up, like I did right here. Make sure the hard drive boots first, and then you turn the security off. So that's pretty much what you gotta do. And the third thing, uh, I know guys have issues with some issues with this between the legacy support, see, and UEFI always choose legacy support legacy all right exit save changes we should boot right up Now, I haven't added any games. This is straight out the box. Alright, I haven't added any games. This is straight out the box, guys. Um, so, all the games you see on here, all the games that I show you, it's that's what you get of course you can add more games that's no problem you want to watch more other videos on how to do that you can um, so we're gonna see what they get all 
alright cool pretty much the same look as the two terabyte one so uh, you got favorites you got 3DO, Amiga, Amiga CD, Amstrad, GX, 4000 some of this shit I never even heard of Apple II, Arcade, Atari, 2600, Atari 5200, Atari 7800 Atari 800, Jaguar, Lynx, Atari ST, Atomic Wave, ColecoVision, Commodore 64, FB Neo, Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color, Ju LCD, I, I hope I'm saying that right, MAME, Intellivision, Xbox, MSX, Neo Geo, Neo Geo CD, Neo Geo Pocket, Neo Geo Pocket Color, Nintendo 3DS, Nintendo 64, Nintendo 64 uh, Drive, Nintendo DS, regular Nintendo, Nintendo GameCube, Nintendo Switch, Nintendo Wii, Video Pack, Beats of Rage, PC Engine, CD-ROM 2, PC FX, Pokemon Mini, Ports, Pi Games, Scum BM, I don't know what they were. Mega C Sega Mega CD, Dreamcast, Game Gear, Sega Master System, Sega Mega Drive, Naomi, Sega Saturn, SG-1000, Sharp X-68000, PlayStation, PS2, PS3, PSP, Super Nintendo, Super Graphics, Vectrex, Virtual Boy, Supervision, Wii U, Games for Windows, it's pretty much PC games. Wonder Swan, Wonder Swan Color, Sinclair, ZX81, Sinclair, ZX Spectrum, that's pretty much it. So, I'll go through these one by one and show you guys what the games are. We'll start with 3DO. Oop, hit the wrong button. Actually, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna. Uh, where's my controller? Let me look up my controller. Instead of using my keyboard. Alright, here we go. Alright. Okay, now. 3DO. Let's see what they got. Alone in the Dark. Clemmings. Need for Speed. Yeah, I like them. Oh, shit. Road Rash. That was my shit. Samurai Showdown, Space Hulk, Star Control 2, Star Fighter, and then the Wing Commander 3 games. Yeah, that's the one with Mark Hamill's in it, yeah. Alright, that's 3DO. Amiga. Never played Amiga. Um, a lot of fuck games. A lot of games. I'm gonna have to go through all of them, but. Uh, it has 21. 100 games, over 2100. Amiga CD32, that's got 136 games. And all of that, yep, alright. Amstrad CPC, that has over 1900 games. I never had these games. I mean, I never. Oh, my bad, my bad, y'all. Alright, um. Yeah, so. It's a lot of fun games. Okay. GX4000. Never heard of that either. But. Yep. Yeah, a lot of games there. You know. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Alright. Cool. Apple II. It has over 1,500 games. <laughs> ALF. They got an ALF game. That's funny. They didn't even know ALF had his game. Look at ALF. <laughs> Hell no. Um, alright, that's cool. Uh, arcade, just like main, pretty much. There's 2,500 games. I think y'all already know by now as far as like arcade, what all the games they got. I'm pretty sure they got like, you know, all the popular shit you know. Um, yeah, we'll have to go through all that, but yeah. Arcade, Atari 2600, that has over 2,200 games, a lot of damn games. Yeah, so, why uh, you get the picture. Alright. 
Atari 5200 that has 99 games. Yep. Old school. Love it. Atari 7800. They came out in 91. I have no idea that came out in no, 91. This came out in 91. Uh, Alright. Atari 800. That's 1979. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright. So we're going through that. No, 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 no. That's cool. A lot of games. Wow, that has uh, 5,400 games. Alright, Jaguar. That's got 56 games. That's cool. Yeah, I only had a. I had Jaguar, but I only like a couple of the games they had. Alien vs. Predator, Rayman, and uh. Yeah, I forgot the others. I mean, it was alright. Lynx, uh. That handheld, yeah. Didn't do as good as Game Gear and uh. Game Boy, but. It had its some games. It has 93 games. Atari ST, I never heard of that. Well, I'm sure that's one of the. It has over 3,300 games. That's a lot of damn games. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Yep. Thomas Wave. Only seven games. They haven't made a lot of games for Thomas Wave, but. You know, pretty much like the ones on the other ones. Dolphin Blue, Fist of North Star, Rumble. Rumble Fist is a good game. ColecoVision. It has 169 games. Oh shit, I remember that Popeye game on there. Yeah, I remember that. Burger Time. Yeah, ColecoVision. Man, that was the shit, man. I'm an 80s kid, so. Yeah. Qbert, all them. Oh hell yeah. Qbert. Oh yeah, that was the shit. Smurf. Oh, yeah, that Smurf game. Yeah. I used, to, I used to die all the time in that fucking Smurf game. That shit was hard, man. We, I was only like three years old. That shit was hard. Alright, <clears throat> Commodore 64, never got, never had that. Um, yeah, so, that's how many games they got. That's got 6,900 games. God damn, that's a lot of games. So, FB Neo, shit, that got 6,600 games. Now, FB Neo, that's, that's mainly like, um, fucking, um, that's like a mixture of Capcom games and Neo Geo games, yeah. It's like a mixture of those games, really. And then like you like Konami games in that too, I think. Capcom, Konami, Neo Geo, pretty much, yeah. Yeah, right, right, right. That's a decent amount. Game Boy, all right. That has thirteen hundred games. I'm sure they got all the classics on here. Game Boy. I miss Game Boy. Those are shit. I'm sure they got all your favorites on there. You know they got Tetris. Don't even, I ain't even gotta mention that one. Cool. Game Boy Advance. That was a good one too. That has over 2,700 games. Pretty much. You know. Uh, yeah. 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 You get the picture. Game Boy Color. That has 1,400 games. I'm sure they got a shit ton of Pokemon shit. Cause. I remember that was known for that. Game Boy Advance and Game Boy Colors is a shit ton of Dragon Ball and Pokemon games. Now, this Jew LCD, I've never even heard of this. I'm assuming it's LCD game. Yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. LCD game. Hmm. A lot of Donkey Kong games. Yeah. So, I'm not familiar with this system, so I don't know. They got, they got Mario games? Mario games? Oh, cool. MAME, that's pretty much like arcade, so it has 1800 games. Over 1800. So I'm assuming pretty much if you, uh. I don't know why I didn't go in. Oh, okay, cool. Pretty much if you, uh. Whatever you don't find on an arcade list, you, you know, you probably find it here and vice versa, shit like that. Pretty much arcade games, just, you know, it's just in a different category or whatever, I don't know. So, 
in television that has over 176 games. Let's see. I remember this system too. It had this the one with the knob on it. We were looking at a system. Regular Xbox. They only got one game. Take lame as hell. Just said. That's cool. Just said. That's a good. That's a good game though. I don't know why the picture ain't pop up though. Oh, this is like goof. All right, there we go. Yeah, just said that was a good game. Just said radio. But like I said, guys, you can put <clears throat> you can put Xbox games on here. Like I said, I know I know where you get all the rums and shit. Um, oh shit, GTA that was on Xbox too. See, I ain't, I ain't had the first Xbox before, but I heard it was a decent system. I, you know, I like my 360. I, you know, I got that emulator on that too. But but yeah. Like, like I was saying, you can you can put you can put ROMs on here. You know, you just gotta like I said, I, I showed you guys before. If you use the laptop, you can't you can't look at the files. And you can't um, add and delete games without going into the into the into the files. You hit F1 on your laptop, you will not go in there. What you have to do is you have to plug up a, a Bluetooth keyboard. Find a you know go to your you know Best Buy or whatever. Get a keyboard with a USB, you know, Bluetooth ship. It's gonna come with a mouse. Plug that in it's into your laptop and use the keyboard as an external keyboard, not your actual laptop keyboard. And you will be able to go into the files. Hit F1. You'll be able to go into the files, and um, like I said, you'll be able to transfer ROMs, uh, delete ROMs, all that shit. It's real easy. I made a video. You guys just look through the, yeah, MSX. I never heard of this system. But it's old school too, pretty much. MSX. Is that a Microsoft system? I don't know. Neo Geo. That's my shit. 160 games. I'm pretty sure they got all the classes on here. All your Art of Fighting's, King of Fighters, Fatal Furies, Metal Slugs. Y'all get the picture. All right, Neo Geo CD. I never had that one. Ninety-seven games, pretty much the same shit. I just ne I never understood Neo Geo CD though, cause I mean, the graphics weren't like they they weren't they, they didn't really you know it was just it was just a CD version of Neo Geo. Graphic wise, it wasn't impressive. Um, all right, Neo Geo Pocket, only ten games kind of cheap with these guys but I mean if you like Nintendo no, Neo, Neo Geo Pocket I guess I don't know I, I never got into a Neo Geo Pocket Color yeah, yeah I mean I don't know I never never got into that one Nintendo 3DS that's my shit six games oh, of course they got Animal Crossing Monster Hunter, nice. And Zelda, you gotta have Zelda for show, sure, for show. Sure. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, like I said, guys, you can add more games and shit, but they only give you six. Want, want. Nintendo 64, 517 games. I'm sure they got, you know, the usual Super Mario 64, Golden Eye. Wave Race, I'm sure they got all that. Cruising USA, you know, those classics, Kirby, oh shit, man, yep, Mario Golf, all that shit, cool, cool, cool. Nintendo 64, DD, that's only got 11 games. I never understood the whole expansion pack thing, it's just so you can save your games and all that, or do some funny shit with it, I, I don't know, it was, it was stupid. Nintendo DS, 550 games. Yeah, I like DS. DS was cool. Pretty much got, yeah. I'm sure they got all the classic shit. I'm sure they got all the Mario's and shit. Yeah. Regular Nintendo, it's got 2,900 games. Classics, you already know. Make sure they got all the classics. Punch Out, that's my shit. Love my Mike Tyson Punch Out. Let's see if they got 
I don't know if they named it Mike Tyson Punch Out. They just named it Punch Out because I know they they got rid of his image on the on the um the original Punch Out. I don't know why that's. I don't know, but I mean it ain't Punch Out without Mike Tyson. Oh, they got it. Mike Tyson Punch. They got the Europe version and Japan version. Nice. All right. Cool. Uh, GameCube. 25 games. They ain't cheap with these games. <clears throat> but, you know, you, you know, it's 500 gigs, so... I mean... They got... They, at least they got all this. Then they got the Collector's Edition of Zelda. That's my shit. Ocarina. They got Four Swords. You got Ocarina and Master Quest, Wind Waker, and Twilight. Oh shit, that's what's up. They got the Mario Karts, of course. They got the Metroid Prime, that was the shit. You got Resident Evil 4, you already know. Hell yeah, Soul Calibur with Link in it. Oh, that's the shit. Super Mario Sunshine, okay. So they got like the, 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 the hits. They got the hits, but. The, yeah, yeah. Decent, decent. Switch you only got one game. Damn. Probably because it takes a lot of, you know, it takes a lot of memory, you know. I mean, each game is probably like four, three or four gigs, you know what I mean? So, because um, what I did on, on this one, on the, what I did with this one, I, I, I killed all the, all the, um, the Atari shit, the Amiga games. The Apple games, all that shit. I killed all that. I, I, I start, I start with the regular Nintendo on up. Even I, I got rid of even the Nintendo games. I mean, well, they kept like you know Punch Out and just Tecmo Bowl and you know, uh, the shit I grew up on. You know, just but as far as like the heavy games, the games that you know, they're like three or four gigs and shit. Like I, I kept those, but. You can definitely add Switch games, bro. I got I'm playing Met Metroid uh, Dread right now on, on this one. I put Metroid Dread on this one, uh, and my other Switch games that I like. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I just all I did was delete all the other games that I don't really play, and I got like the heavy heavy hitters on there. So as long as you, I mean, you know, you know what I'm showing you, they actually have these emulators on here for this for this new. This new hard drive I'm showing you now. You know, the fact that they have the emulators on here already. They got Switch, they got GameCube, and they got PlayStation 2 on here, PlayStation 3. The fact that you know that already, all you gotta do is just add the games. That's it. You only have to fuck with, like, trying to find the emulator or shit like that. It's already on here. All you have to do is just add the games to it. That's it. Alright, we It's got only three games. So, let's see. Mario Galaxy 2, nice. Smash Brothers, of course, and Zelda, of course, yeah. Cool. Uh, video Pack, never heard of that. Uh, that came out the year I was born, 1980, shit. That shit, oh, said, oh, I'm going too far, my bad, my bad. Alright, so, yep, that's a, that's a 1980 game. Beats of Rage, oh yeah, see, I love that shit, I love Beats of Rage, because these games... 169. These games have like this altered version of side scrollers and different types of games that you grow with, Streets of Rage and all that shit. They'll put like Ryu in it. See, they got this one. They got Ryu playing like in a side scrolling fighting game. Like, I love that shit. Alien vs. Predator. Aftermath. I never even heard of that one. I'm, I'm, they say it's a remix of the arcade version. That's the shit, man. And see, they got like like all these games right here. They got very, they got like people, different characters in other games, and put them in other type of games. Like, look at Batman. This is a big ass Batman. He put him in a side scroll. Battle Toes. This shit cool. I like this. Beats of Rage. Like, Streets of Rage was a shit, man. But you know, I do like the old one better. I like the new one though, but. It's cool they remade it though. You know, for the. Oh shit, Christ is Evil. Oh, they got like a Resident Evil side scroller? Oh man, I gotta make a video on that. That's what's up. 
Nice. Crisis Evil 3. It looks like. Is that like Dino Crisis? Oh, okay. See, see these games are just. Um, they're like fan made games, but they're fun though. Because they put you in these sides. But Dante must kill. <laughs> That's funny. Dante from. Uh, that will make Cry is funny. Yeah, I like this. Okay. Man, they got Ryu on another game. Double, they got a shit ton of Double Dragon games. Yeah, yeah. Double Dragon was nice. It was decent. Dragon Duo. They got a Dragon Ball Z. Is that a side school or a fighter? It looks like a fighting game. So, yeah, these are pretty much like fan made games. They got like, you know, just a bunch of characters and different. And other games. Shit, that's cool. That's cool. I like this Golden Axe. Nice. I like the He-Man one. That He-Man one is the shit, man. You can pick He-Man. You can pick Lionel from Thundercats. I love that shit, man. And it's like a side-scrolling fighting game. This shit fun, though. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, y'all get the picture. Damn, side-scrolling Marvel superheroes. That's funny as hell. Marvel vs. DC Comics. Oh, hell no. They... Okay, cool. They got a Mega Man. Mega Man game. Mega Sonic. Metal Gear Origin. Oh, shit. Uh, my bad. Metal Gear. <laughs> That's funny. They got Metal Gear in a side scrolling game. Oh, it's crazy. Just, I'm, just, I'm just showing y'all a little, you know. It's, it's cool, cool, cool. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Street Fighter beats the rage. Hell no. That's regular Street Fighter. That's the first one. Strider 3? Damn. Strider X. Super Mario Brawl. Oh, that's, that's cute. I don't know what the fuck that is. Ninja Turtles. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, I'm playing this. Yeah. So, yeah. That's, yeah, that's pretty much beats the rage. Oh, shit. Gambit. Oh, that's my, oh, that's my dude. Gambit. Yeah. That's crazy. They, they, they made these fighting games side scrollers. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, PC Engine. That's 413 games. That's pretty much Turbo Graphics, is out. I think PC Engine was like the the Japanese version of Turbo Graphics 16, but Yeah. I remember Bunk's Adventure. That was my shit. Blazing Lasers, oh hell yeah. That was my shit on Turbo Graphics. That was yeah, Bloody Wolf. Oh, that was my shit too. Damn. Y'all Bunks Adventure. Hell yeah. Yeah. So, China Warrior, that was the shit too. Alright, so yeah, PCN, that's pretty much Turbo Graphics. They got all the classics. CD, PC, uh, oh, PC Engine, CD ROM, yeah. I've got to have a CD ROM version. I don't. That's 70 games. I don't know. I'm pretty much. I don't know. It's a CD version of PC Engine, I guess, yeah. Alright, PCFX. I never heard of that one, but that has six games. Let's see what we got. Uh, okay. Alright. Uh, yeah, I never knew about these games. Pokemon Mini has 43 games. You got all your Pokemon games. They look. Oh, they look like they're, they're like uh, LCD games, I guess. Yeah. It's a shit ton of these. Damn. Uh, <clears throat> ports. Not sure what ports are. Oh, okay, I guess. Oh, they got a bunch of Doom. Uh, Doom games, variations of Doom. Okay, alright, alright. Cool. Pie game, I don't know what the fuck that is. Only one. Retro trivia. Lame. Scum VM. That's 55 games. Um, yeah, I think it's like uh, these look like PC ish games. Elvira, hell yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, these look like yeah. If you remember like PC games back in like 91, 92 type shit, yeah. I remember that one game, that Larry game. Yeah, Leisure Larry. Leisure Suit Larry, yeah. <laughs> they used to have these, and they used to have these, um, if you ever 
get a, 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 a PC World magazine. They used to have um, like free games and that shit, like CDs and shit. I remember mean, one time they had like a Leisure Larry CD in that motherfucker. Yeah, I remember this. Monkey Island. Yeah. Yeah, these are like the old PC games. Sam and Max. Y'all, y'all know what y'all know what that is. All right, Mega CD. That's pretty much Sega CD, I guess. That's 82 games. So I'm pretty sure they got. Yep. All the good Sega CD games on here. <laughs> Corpse Killer. My. Yeah, Earthworm Jim. Mike Dowell. Echo the Dolphin, yeah. Eternal Champions, that was the shit, yeah. Final Fantasy CD, hell yeah. Yeah, Jurassic Park. So they got, yeah, they pretty much got all your. Yeah. All the goals on there, Mortal Kombat, yeah. Cool, cool. Road Rash, hell yeah. yeah Supreme Warrior. Yeah, it was kind of lame, but Terminator, nice. Alright, Dreamcast, 50 games. Okay, cool. So I'm sure they got all oh, they got. They gotta have Crazy Taxi, man. Come on now. Dead or Alive 2, Crazy Taxi, Jet Grind Radio for sure. Marvel's Capcom 2, yup, yup. Power Stone, gotta have Power Stone. Resident Evil, Cold Veronica, yep. Shinmu, oh, you gotta have, oh yeah. You gotta have Shinmu. I still haven't finished that game, but I love it so much. I never finished the motherfucker. Sonic Adventure, of course. Space Channel, <laughs> hell yeah. Do I? I think that's the one with Michael Jackson. In. They got, it's like some kind of code. You, you, you can get my House of Dead too. Yeah, nice, cool, cool. Virtual tennis, cool. Game Gear, four hundred and ninety games. So, I'm pretty sure all your favorite Game Gear games are on here. So I don't have to go through all that. Sega Master System, 530 games. This is this is pre Sonic, so I never got it. I never had Sega Master System. The first Sega system I had was Genesis. That was the that was the baby right there. I remember those Nintendo don't uh, ads that they had. <laughs> Nintendo don't. I was like hell no. All right. Mega Drive. That's pretty much Genesis. I mean, um, I think this, this is the J Japan version of Sega Genesis, pretty much. So, Naomi, 80 games. Nice. Like, this got a decent amount of Naomi games. Um, I don't remember Naomi games having this many games, but that's nice. That they, they got more Naomi games than Dreamcast games on this. That's cool. So they got all the Naomi games on here. Nice, real nice. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Metal Blood Act. Oh, Melty Blood Act, my bad. Monkey Ball, Power Star, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Spawn, that was my shit, yeah. Yeah. Virtual NBA. That was that was decent too, Virtual NBA. Royal Rumble, hell yeah. Alright, Sega Saturn, we got 28 games. Cool. Sega Saturn was decent, man. They could have did a lot with that, a lot more. House of the Dead, Pants of Dragon, Knights. Gotta have Knights in the Dreams. That was the shit. Sega Rally, of course, yeah. She fought Alpha 2, okay, yep. Yeah. Virtual Cop, of course, yep. Yeah. Alright. Uh, SG-1000, yeah, that's the Sega, yeah, I never had it, that's 200 games, yeah, I never had that either, that was way back when, that was early, this is early Sega, right here, yeah, early Sega, Sharp X-68000, 495 games, so, yeah, it's a lot of games. PlayStation 700 games you get 700 games on this hard drive of PlayStation games that's a lot of games guys that's a lot of fucking games and PlayStation of course like come on everybody loves first PlayStation I mean come on man 
Yeah. I'm pretty sure they got all my favorites on here. Oh, yeah. Battle Arena Toshida. Damn. I used to love this game. This is before uh, Soul Calibur and all them, man. I mean, arcades, I think they came around the same time. But, yeah. Battle Arena Toshida. No, hell yeah, man. Bloody Roar. You already know. Yup. Bugs Bunny and Taz. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> I remember that. Yup. Wow. A lot of games. I'm sure they got, you know, the Resident Evils and shit like that. Let me go through it real quick. Yeah, yeah. Destruction Derby, love it. Dino Crisis, yep. All the Disney movies. Dragon Ball Z. Earthworm 2. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see. Final Fantasy. Well, I don't see Final Fantasy 7, though. No, come on, man. They ain't got 7 on here? I mean, they got, yeah, they, okay, three Final Fantasy games. I guess. I like seven. That was my shit, man. Gex, Gex, Gex 3. Oh, they got the first Gran Turismo. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see what else they got. Mm hmm. Marvel vs. Capcom, yep, Mega Man, X5, 6, 7, all that shit. Yeah, NBA Jam Extreme, I remember that. <clears throat> um, so, yeah. Got a lot of damn games on it, yeah. 700 games, god damn. There we go, Resident Evil 2, 3, Resident Evil Director's Cut, Resident Evil Survivor, I already knew those were in. Ridge Racer, that's my shit. Nice, nice, nice. So, alright, that's 700 of this. Yeah. Alright, cool. PlayStation 2 got 30 games. Now, PlayStation 2 is pretty heavy as far as like the. Um, uh, as far as like how big the files are. I, th I think they're in. I think they're in the gigs. One or two gigs a game. Maybe. Yeah, it's pretty high up there. They got Don't Make Cry, of course. Don't Make Cry 3. It's my shit. Final Fantasy 10, 12. Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Vice City and 3. Oh, hell yeah. King of Heart, Kingdom Hearts. Metal Gear 2 and 3. Hell yeah. Resident Evil 4. Hell yeah. Silent Hill 2. Yes. Tekken 5. Yes. Virtual Fighter 4. Yes. Nice, nice. Alright, decent, decent amount. No. They say it's three of oh, yeah yeah. You only get one game out of this. Castlevania, why why? Well again, like I said, at least they have the actual emulators on here, so all you have to do is add the games. That's it. PSP, one hundred and thirty one games. Fly damn games. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, PSP was decent. It really was. I only got it for God of War and um, those tech that Tekken game they had. They never have God of War on here. I, I don't know why. I, I mean, I have it on mine, um, my other hard drive. I don't know why they never put the God of War on here. Maybe because, you know, once you start it up, you got to tweak it. Like, you got to tweak the graphics. You got to tweak the... Because the emulator itself, uh, it, by default... For God of War, it's it, it like it's slow, like the shit's gonna just it's real it, like it moves slow. You gotta tweak it. It's not the game. It's not your computer. None of that. All you gotta do is just tweak the graphics and shit. There's videos out there for it. That's how I learned to do mine. And then you know, but I can. Um, I mean, I one day I can show you guys make a video on how to uh, tweak your PSP games if they're playing. If they're playing all goofy and slow and shit. Um, that, like I said, all you gotta do is just tweak the tweak tweak some shit, bro, and it'll play like no problem. Terminator that was a good one too. I like Terminator. All right, that's PSP. Uh, Super Nintendo, thirty nine hundred games. I'm pretty sure they got all the favorites on here. Thirty nine hundred games. Super Nintendo, hell yeah. Star Fox, fucking um, the 
Mario games. Y'all know, y'all already know. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they got all of them on there. Super Nintendo is decent. Super Graphics, that's 300 games. Super Graphics was kind of like, was it like, was it like Turbo Graphics 16 almost? I think some like it. I think it's all under the same umbrella, pretty much. But yeah, so this is Super Graphics. I never had it, but yeah. Vet Vectrex has 77, 77 games. These are like the old school, like real old looking games. You know, if you're into that one, Vectrex, they got it. Okay, cool. Virtual Boy. I like Virtual Boy. Everybody was hating on that when that came out, man. Fuck y'all. That was 3D, man. That shit was fun for what it was, man. You can't play it 2D. Like, I don't even know why they have it on here. It ain't even fun if it's not in 3D. So you're not really getting a full experience 2D. I, I really don't get the point of playing it in 2D. It makes no sense. But yeah, at least you know, you know, virtual boy. All right, Super Supervision. Never heard of that. 63 games. Uh, looks like Game Boy games. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. All right, Wii U, one game. And again, these <laughs> the reason why I did it put like one game, PS3, one game for Mario. These games are heavy, man. They're like two, three gigs and shit. So Mario Eight, Mario Kart Eight, cool. That was a good one. Games for Windows. They only had one game, one PC game. That's Plants vs Zombies. All right. Wonder Swan, 124 games. That's some handheld shit too, right? Yeah, looks like Game Boy shit. Okay. Wonder Wonder Swan Color. Wait, how many games? 102 games. Same shit. It's like Game Boy Color, pretty much. That's what it looked like to me. I mean, yeah, that's that's shit you want. Digi Digimon. They got a bunch of Digimon games. All that Pokemon shit. Final Fantasy, Dragon Ball, oh, One Piece, that uh, anime, they got them games, okay, they got Hunter x Hunter games too, I didn't, I had no idea, huh, okay, Wonder, Wonder Swan, I never played that system, okay, cool, Sinclair, 826 games, definitely old school, 1981, so, you know, if you were into these games, here you go. Alright, Sinclair Spectrum. 5,200 games. Oh, shit, they had Rambo on, on the cover. Rambo, man, that's my shit, man. But yeah, so, yeah, if you had the Sinclair the X Spectrum, here you go. They you got, you probably got all, probably pretty much every game on here, because these old ass games, they're they're only probably like about at the most one megabyte. Like a lot of these are like eight hundred kilobytes, seven hundred kilobytes, shit like that. So yes, yeah, so they don't take up much space. All right, that's cool. So that's all of them, guys. Um, you know, so like I said, this is right out the box. Can't hang five hundred gig hard drive. This new one shit, you know, you want to pick it up, superconsole-x.com, for sure, so I will see you guys in the next video, take care.